Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Jessica Marie. Um, if you're new to my channel, please like and subscribe. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. It's just a quick get ready with me. It's nothing really special, it's just what I do. And um, yeah, so you guys can please like and subscribe and I would really appreciate it. And I will link everything that I'm using in the description box below. Okay, now let's get into the video. So today I'm actually going to see my mom and my dad. I'm going to go pay for a visit. And I think we're going to watch the movie, I mean the show, um, This Is Us. If you guys don't watch it, it's such a great show. I love it. It's really great. So I'm just going to get ready for that. So let's get into it. Um, first, I'm going to put in my ColourPop Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Acid. Whenever I am doing just a quick, easy get ready with me, I feel like the best thing to do is to put have basically like a dewy face not matte or anything so this is what i'm going to put in this pretty fresh hyaluronic acid primer oh my god it feels so good okay so now we have the primer and everything next i'm going to just have that like dry a little bit um my face is red because i am i my face is really sensitive in this combination so well, it's combination like it's both oily and dry, and it's also really sensitive. So, yeah. <laughs> so next, what am I going to do? I Oh, I already did my eyebrows. I use my uh, L'Occitane Soap Brow. It's a little soap, and what I do, I put water on. I'll probably do a video on that one day. But I put water on it, and then I get my spoolie, and I just brush it out. Then I apply my Benefit Precisely My Brow. This one is in the shade 3.5. Such a great shade great 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 um brow product i really like it so what i like to do for an easy eyeshadow i don't like to do a lot especially because i'm quickly on the go let's go and i want to be done so i usually use the bronzes i'm using so these are my top bronzers actually this is my favorite bronzer it's great i love it i already hit pan on it this is what it looks like it's a benefit not benefit is there, it's a Physician Formula Butter Bronzer in the shade Bronzer. Then I have the Benefit Hula. Such a great one. It's more um, orangey toned in a way. Wait, it's more neutral pinkish, I feel, base. And I've been really liking the Maybelline City Bronzer in the shade 200. It's a really good bronzer. This one this is what it looks like. So... Oh, and recently I actually got a new bronzer. It's a Morphe Icon Nick bronzer. This is what it looks like. It's really big. It's really big. So actually, I'm going to be safe and I'm going to go with the bronzer I always use, which would be the Physicians Formula Formula Butter Bronzer. Let me just... Okay, so what I like to do first is when I'm doing my eyeshadow, the only thing that I really like to conceal is under my brow, just to have more of a sharper line. I get my concealer. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. And I like to get a little brush. Um, this is an Eco Tools brush. It's a flat brush. And I just want to outline my eyebrow. That's all I do. It's really simple. So for my first shade on my crease, I'm going to be using my Alamar Cosmetics number one brush. This is what it looks like. Such a great fluffy brush. I'm going to put that in here. Just like that. And there we go. And just apply it in my crease. I just want to apply however much I want to get my desired look today. It's just a little something. I used to do this when I had work. I used to um, just apply eyeshadow and everyone, not everyone, but the, I would get a lot of compliments on this. So this is what we have for now. And next, I'm gonna actually put on foundation. It's really easy, my eyes are really easy. And I'm going to be using the Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Acid Tinted Moisturizer. This one in medium 9W. It's just such a great foundation brush. Okay. 
And then I'm going to be using my Jaclyn Hill JH03 brush. So actually on the parts where I need more coverage, coverage, I like to apply concealer. So I have some of the leftover right here, what I had right here. It was some of the leftover concealer in the Maybelline Fit Me. And I'm just gonna spot, just do spots. This one, not really. And now I'm gonna apply my concealer. So for my concealer, I'm gonna be using the ColourPop Pretty Fresh Hyaluronic Acid Creamy Concealer. Such a great concealer. Go right here. And whoop. I actually saw this in a TikTok, this method, and I actually really like it. There. So I'm just going to leave that right there. And then I'm going to get some more of my foundation, just buff it in there. I'm gonna let my concealer dry for around, just until I'm done with most of my face. Honestly, my face is not gonna be perfect, but I just don't wanna wear full coverage. I don't like what I do with my usual YouTube videos. I don't want that, I just want very natural, simple, look okay I'm back I don't know why but it just cut off I don't know why but all I did was curl my lashes actually um, I want to blend out especially my right here before I apply um before I apply my mascara so I'm gonna be using my trusty morphe g4 brush and I'm gonna just blend everything out And with whatever mascara I have, I just like to mascara. <laughs> what? Whatever concealer I have, I just like to blend it out like that. There. When I'm done blending out my concealer under my eye and at the sides, I want to go back in with my bronzer that I'm going to be using. And I'm going to go back in with the same brush. I'm going to go back in with it and then I'm just going to re-add some stuff. Because when I was blending it out, some of the concealer wiped it away in a way. Okay, so after that, now I'm actually going to add some under, because my under eyes crease a lot. So I'm going to add some of the Rimmel Transparent 001 powder. And I'm going to be taking my Eco, my trusty Eco Tools brush, this one. It's such a great brush, especially for under your eyes. I love it. And I'm just going to stamp that under my eyes like that, just to have some powder for And just apply the rest if I have any on my face so now I'm gonna be applying my mascara and just doing my eyelashes so I'll be right back uno momento there we go and now I'm gonna go in with the nude mood color pop collection and I'm gonna be applying some of this shimmer shade right here I know I kind of had to press it back in because it didn't come out good. But I'm going to get that. I'm going to apply some of that shimmer shade and stamp it right here. Just for a little bit. Inner corner highlight. After I did that, I'm going to actually just apply a little bit of bronzer. We're actually almost done with the look. Almost done. 
just a little, just to warm up the base. And I like to do it in circular motions. Okay, so we already have the bronzer, the foundation, concealer, the eyeshadow. It's really simple. Some inner corner highlight. Oh, I'm not sure if I told you the name, but the inner corner highlight, the name is Wink Wink. It's in the Nude Mood palette. This one. Oh, there you go. Sorry. Um, it's this one. It's in here. I love it. This is such a great palette. It's really cute. Look. Really cute. It kind of reminds me of the Going Coconuts, but a little bit warmer, in my opinion. I feel like Going Coconuts is very neutral. Okay, so next is blush. And for blush, I want to do my old-time favorite, the Bare Peach by Burt Bees. This one. It's such a pretty color. I love it. It's really pretty. It's really pinky. It's really gorgeous. If you guys hear music, my grandma's in the background singing and listening to music. Like right now, she's uh, listening to Journeys. Don't Stop Believing. She's listening to Don't Stop Believing by Journey. And apply some blush right there. <laughs> and then I'm gonna get this big Jaclyn Hill JH01 brush and just blend everything in. Okay. After that, if I have any lip gloss, lip anything, I'm, I'm just going to take a towel and wipe my lips. Okay. So this is what my lips look like. This is what we have right now. I'm going to get the LA Girl lip liner in... I keeping it, keep it spicy. And I'm just going to go in the outer parts. Just gonna do it like that and then after I'm going to take my little color pop lip these and I'm gonna take Z boys this shade this one right here ah <laughs> this one right here this one looks like just like that okay so this is the makeup look, you guys. This is a quick, easy, get ready with me. I usually get this done within 10 minutes for everything. Um, I hope you like it. I'm gonna edit it now. I only did like 20 minutes of this video, so I hope I could bring it down. Um, thank you, you guys. Um, I just wanna say thank you to everyone that's out there working, especially grocery store workers, um, truck drivers, uh, the, the emergency response team, nurses, doctors. Um, I really appreciate that. And everyone, please stay safe, practice social distancing, and just, this is the only time we could actually spend with our family, whether we're alone in our apartment or in our room or anything. This is a time where we could just FaceTime a cousin or FaceTime your tia and from Mexico or something like that. Like, just get get into that and just this is the only time we can say okay we actually have free time please connect with your loved ones treat every day as if it's your last day because we don't know how much longer we're going to be on this earth so please 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 practice social distancing and just have a wonderful day if you guys can um yeah so bye you guys oh also sorry <laughs> so please like and subscribe and i'll see you next time Bye, you guys. <laughs>